guys. It's me, <laughs> Welcome to my channel. Let me do a little introduction, I suppose. So I'm thinking this is going to be my first video to my channel. And with that being said, I would love to do a little introduction on what this channel is going to consist of. And that being pretty much just fashion-based content. And please, if you have any video requests or ideas for my channel, my baby little channel, please like comment them or hit me up on my socials, which will be somewhere over here and down in my little description description box. <laughs> oh my god, the couch is so squeaky. <laughs> Speaking of couch, she's mine. She's mine. So continuing on about my channel, content wise, I'm aiming for like videos of me sourcing new clothing pieces. Um, I work at a secondhand clothing store. So whether that be me finding cool pieces, which this whole fit is actually from my store. And then I love to go thrifting, whether that be the racks or the Goodwill bins. <laughs> This video is overall pretty much based on my personal collection and curation of my closet, which I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty, pretty dope. I've been collecting clothes for a really long time now, and it just keeps growing at this point, and so I would love to share that with others since pretty much a whole portion of my clothing is secondhand and you guys know that you come by it once and like you don't see those pieces very often so I'd love to share that with the internet. Anywho, that's what my channel is going to be pretty much based on. This, this is, is just a, a quick, quick disclaimer, disclaimer about, about the meowing, the meowing in the background. background. We have just a very vocal cat. What's the species called? Bangle. She's bangle. a bangle She's cat. A bangle. It's my roommate. Most, like vocal and she likes us. She wants to unbox. Yeah, she wants to be a part. So if you want to see her, let us know. Anywho, so let's get on with the video. So this video is an exciting one. Basically, with this humongous box right here is, and where it's from is Japan. Japan offers a little secondhand eBay Macari-like platform where you can source clothing pieces, furniture pieces, decor, and the list goes on. This is my second box that I've sourced. What this box consists of, so I've been curating this box for the past month. It came in today, I'm so ready to open it. What's basically inside it is I sourced a bunch of decor pieces, which is a first because normally I refer to this online platform as a source for clothing pieces, but I'm getting a new place soon and I just fell upon not one, but two, but just a handful of different one-of-a-kind pieces that I just don't think I'll ever come across. And with my future place in mind, I would love to start my collection. So let's get unboxing some pieces brand wise that will be in this box is Hysteric Glamour, one and only, and just some Fruits magazines. So let's dig in. Protection. And let's dig in. Let's dig in. Starting off strong. It's feeling thin. <gasps> Notebook. Nope. Yikes. New in packaging. So with the new year coming around, a goal of mine is to become more avid when it comes to journaling. I just feel like having a sick notebook is the first start. Very eager to see what the paper itself looks like. Aw, cute! So I was expecting more like lined paper, you know, like you see in school. What is it called? Notebook paper? Mm -hmm. But it seems more to be like a sketch pad, which is totally fine with me. I write really big, and so my handwriting doesn't even fit in between the lines, so I'm honestly very happy with this purchase. 
First piece down, so much more to go. So this is the one clothing piece I acquired, shocker. But when I saw this piece, like any crochet piece by like Hysteric just like blows my mind. All their knitwear, cardigans, etc. just are absolutely to die for. What do you know it? It's new with tags. I was not expecting that. Always love to like deep search, like read the descriptions, learn everything from the listings to make sure like I know what I'm getting into, and so I did not know it was new with tags, but that's very exciting. But if you couldn't tell, it has little skull and spider patch work crochet knit details. If you know me, you know this is literally me in a sweater. And just the colors and everything, it's me. I love it. I'm so excited. It looks like the perfect fit. Super exciting, ah. <laughs> it's a little bigger than I was expecting. Same thing, no. Oh, like come on. I'm like acquiring my pillow collection. This is my lovely boyfriend, so <laughs> homie unfortunately does not belong to me. I just recently got the Stray Rats Rat Girl Pillow, Vintage Beatles one. I have this like cat one from Ikea. Anyways, I'm like going through like a pillow phase. I just like came across this one. It's green. I love the color green. Goblin looking thing. I love anything like punk, rock, grunge, alternative. And this kind of just like resembled all of that. So here's this one guy. Okay. I think we're down to four more. Okay. Uh, I think these are the magazines. Oh. Yes. I found a listing of not just one or two, but eight fruits magazines. Look at these bad boys. Look at this. Like, you do not come across a whole sale listing for all of these. I do, though, already own this special one. I got it for my birthday. And so with that in mind, this one will be going up for sale. If any of you guys want it, go ahead and reach me on my socials, comment below. We can like work something out. There's like a little sneak peek into it. Yeah, if you're not familiar with fruits fashion, um, it's basically a whole photo shoot resolved around people based in Japan. I don't know if it's yeah. just strictly Japan, but uh, just people they find on the streets and they have a sick outfit and boom. It's just great for inspiration. I definitely wanted to um, start a nice magazine book, fashion curation. I just love sourcing it for like inspiration. You know, I love Pinterest, and so I feel like it's another way of not having to bury my head into my phone rather than, you know, I can just pull a book out and mm -hmm. voila. Um, I'm so excited to go digging through these after this video. Oh, we're down to just three more. Oopsies. <laughs> <laughs> wondering like oh did I just get a bowl for like my morning cereal no this is for my beautiful cat Lucy I got her a gorgeous little hysteric bowl because it's only fitting <laughs> didn't think that this would be this small I don't even know what this one is for dipping sauce dipping sauce yeah is it's like the Burger King little mm -hmm. logo Metal King Rock Oh, fine. Yeah, this one's like brand new. It's in really good condition. Yeah. This one looks like it's in really good condition too. It looks a little worn on the bottom, but yeah, okay. yeah. yeah getting it shipped, perfect condition. No like chipping, like love to see it. It makes me really happy because my Lucy deserves only the best. This is what actually started my whole order. If you're familiar with Buy. You know that once you buy something, you're pretty much obligated 
to buy a shit ton because shipping is not the cheapest. I don't even want to say how much I spent shipping. Hey, it's here. I'm more than happy with all my purchases. It's in the past, it's whatever. It came here safely. I think I shipped it out four days ago, five days ago. If that, it's here today, like fast shipping. Um, and yeah, I, I don't have any room to complain, so. This one's light. Mm. I really hope she works, even if she doesn't, like, come on, like, that's a mirror. Say hey, tubers. But I just love this, like, hysteric little graphic design. And when I saw that it was, like, a clock, a mirror, all in one, I was like, this is my clock now. Mm -hmm. It takes a double A battery, and from there, we'll see if it works. We're down to the last item, but this item is very, very exciting, so save the best for last. rug it's a classic bear logo hysteric has yeah this was my haul aftermath yeah. Yeah. so this was my haul i hope you guys stay tuned for the whole video i think it was definitely worth the while if you guys want to see more content like please like shoot me a like like show me some love so i know i should keep going up on this YouTube journey. But with that in mind, uh, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoy this haul. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, please don't hesitate to ask. It was nice hanging with you guys. Peace and love. <laughs>